Greetings on this Wednesday at the Church of the Advent. By now it's become public knowledge that I am resigning from the organist choir master position at this church. As I wrote in my resignation letter, I feel many emotions. And certainly one of the emotions that I feel is gratitude for getting to serve you all these years. At staff meeting, Janelle Smith asked me whether or not I could do a Wednesday Word devotional, and I happily said yes, just because I enjoy speaking to all of you. And today, I thought that I would talk a little bit about references to music in the Bible. Many of us know that if you want to Google something, you can. It's possible to get all kinds of information on the spur of the moment just by typing in something in a search engine and getting all the information you want. And so that's how I was able to determine just how many references to music there are in the Bible. I have my phone right here. And if you go to a page that reads references to music in the Bible on a website called insearchoftruth.org, what it'll tell you is that Unfortunately, music is referenced many times throughout the scriptures. Over 1,150 verses in the Bible reference a form of the following words, which may be related to music. And the article goes on to list the words. I won't list all those words right now, but it is pretty amazing to know that there is a huge number of passages in the Bible that reference music, whether it be through singing, or praising God through instruments. Without reading any specific quotes, I can come to tell you about a few passages that really strike a chord with me. No pun intended. The most obvious one is Psalm 150. Hallelujah. Praise God in his temple. Praise God in the dance. Praise him with many kinds of instruments. Let everything that hath breath Praise the Lord. I think of Psalm 137, by the waters of Babylon. By the waters of Babylon, there we hung our harps. How can we sing God's song in a strange land? That's just so ripe with imagery right there. And you could go on and on talking about all the references to music in the Bible. But let's move on to people who've had quotes about music. And one person that comes to mind for me is Martin Luther. Part of the reason why I really respect and love Martin Luther is because I grew up as a Lutheran. And automatically, we know that we have the Lutheran Church because of Martin Luther. Many years ago, probably around 1517, Martin Luther wrote, Next to the word of God, the noble art of music is the greatest treasure in the world. I can certainly say that music is a great treasure. I have become very fortunate to be able to minister to this church over time because of music. Next month, I will talk about some events that lead up to my final Sunday at the church. But for now, please know that you are loved. God bless you and have a wonderful day.